Okay, at what happens when a couple of ways you can put out presentations, which are a popular way to move material to students. One, this first link is to a Google Slides presentation. So I'm going to open that up. You can see already I've got to uh, allow pop-ups for this. So when I click on that link, I'm in Angelina's account here. You see, Angel I'm with Angelina. Uh, it opens it up in uh, the Google Slides page. And then I can see it. I view only. The instructor, the instructor has simply set a shared link to it, uh, which works fine. And uh, if I wish to, I can put it into presentation mode and view it as if it was a presentation on my computer. And go to the next slide. And will take time to load on a link. These images were reduced to 960 by 540. Uh, they're not full. They're originally 4.4 megabyte images, but they've been reduced down. So, but they're all up now. They're all in place. So, with that, it will come out of there. So that's that one. I'll, I'll go back to here. If I, this is a PowerPoint. Again, a link. Attached is a link. The first one was a link to a Google Slides presentation. The second one is the Invasive Plants PowerPoint. Now, this is uploaded as a PowerPoint. It's the same presentation, but coming up as a PowerPoint. Um, they have to load this PDF viewer when they're working on the desktop to pull the document up. Which it, it, it can stall on, on one. Wait and see. And this is one reason I don't like the PDF viewer. I'm on a fairly fast link uh, on Koshai, Truk, and Yap. This can be particularly problematic to get this viewer to display. Once the view is up, though, it's got the same presentation. Now, this is actually a PDF. It was uploaded as a PowerPoint, and a, the student could download it. But I'm currently on a Chromebook, which doesn't run Power, uh, PowerPoint. Uh, so that's not going to do me any uh, particular good to download it as a PowerPoint. I don't have that software, so I might as well look at the PDF here. Um, I can go full screen, and I guess that's a little better. But uh, I'm working in. Uh, I'm working with a, a PDF at this point. Uh, come back out. So that's uh, the the uh, PowerPoint version of it. It's uh, the two ways to share presentations, and let me come back over to the course page here. Um, this one that opens up the uh, the uh, slides is a, a, a Google Slides uh, uh, provides some more capability. The other capability the student has is if they're logged in, they can make up a, a copy and then type notes on it, study it, do things with it. Something to be aware of when you're working with Google Slides. Um, the, the, they can add their own notes to it if they wish by making their own copy that they can then work on and, and use to make it to make their own notes and those sorts of things. So that was all I wanted to do was take a look at what those two things look like.